I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is things you would never find in a jar. In this case, fireworks. I take one finger at the top in the center and underneath I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a flat oval. I come back to the left and draw a straight line down. Come over to the right, draw a straight line down. Come back to the left and draw a slightly curved line up and over, connect. Starting on the left, I'm going to draw a curved line out, straight line down, almost to the end. Come on the right, curved line out, straight line down. Come back to the left and we're just going to draw a slightly curved line over, up, connect and now we're going to mimic that line little straight line on the left little straight line on the right slightly curved line over up and connect starting up here at the top I'm just going to put a dot and from that dot I'm going to go straight line up down out in out in out in out in out, in, connect. Now we're going to draw it again. So put a dot, straight line out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, connect. Now everybody's is going to be different because we all draw differently. Right here in the center, let's draw a baby circle. Now come over down to this side and let's put a dot. And we're going to draw a straight line up, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, connect. Put another dot. We're going to draw it again. Straight line up, out, in, whoops, that's out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, connect, put a little baby circle inside. Come all the way down here to the bottom, let's put a dot, straight line up, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, connect. We're going to draw it again, put a dot, straight line up, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, connect. And let's put a little baby circle. Now come up to the top and we're just going to go straight line down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, and like I said, you might have more or less depending on how you draw. We're going to come back in and we're going to put little straight lines of dots. If they crash into your other firework, it's okay. Straight lines out with dots. Sometimes they'll intersect, other times they won't. This is a decorative straight lines out. Out, 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 out. Then we're going to put some spirals. So spiral one. If you have room, spiral two. Come up to the top, spiral three. Now we come in and we fill in some baby circles. Wherever you have a space, put a baby circle. All the way down and around all of your fireworks. Keep going, keep going, keep going, 
keep going keep going now some of you might have more room go ahead and fill it in with more fireworks more spirals and more baby circles I think that's all oh and one more thing my jar is on a tabletop so I'm going to draw a straight line to the left jump over and a straight line to the right now I've got it sitting on a counter or a table and this is going to be my background okay let's see how we're going to color this in okay since it's fireworks and I'm going to put it for the 4th of July or summer picnic I'm going to do my top red loop-de-loop -loop it I'm going to do my stripes blue an AB AB pattern blue white blue white blue white all the way across then I'm going to take my yellow and I'm going to do my baby circles yellow and then I'm going to do my outside flash yellow okay so these outside fireworks I'm going to do yellow okay each one now the rest of the colors you could do any colors you want but because I want mine to be patriotic I'm going to try and stick to my red white and blue look so I'm going to do my outside fireworks yellow so it looks like they're banging then I'm going to come in with my red I'm going to do my inside firework red okay you will do a way better job than me but you get the general idea okay then and this is the part that is really labor intensive I'm going whoops wrong color hello oh my goodness I forgot my purple hold on hold on very important to have your purple because that is what you're going to loop-de-loop -loop the whole entire part around your fireworks whoops I just went over one of my circles try and keep your baby circles white those are supposed to be like stars in the sky and yes this might take a while but it will look fabulous when you're done this also could be a watercolor project but hey who's got watercolors and I don't have any so I'm just gonna use my crayons crayons are fine but bring your purple all the way down and that's supposed to represent the night sky okay you didn't want to use black because then you'll lose all your dots you don't want to use blue because you've got all this other red white and blue going on so purple is a good dark color still gives you the effect try not to go and color in those white dots okay now at the very bottom bottom of your jar I did this part blue all the way across now to show that I have my jar sitting on a shelf I'm going to do the bottom part of this horizon line that's called a horizon line I'm going to do this yellow stripes but then I'm going to take my black and do black lines on top all the way across okay all right let's see what this looks like all colored in okay here is my things you would never find in a jar finished project and my project today was fireworks you would never find fireworks going off in a jar I hope okay bye bye